Hello, you are welcome. How to solve for hex in this nice multiple linear problem? Here, from what we are given, it is 1 over x square minus 1 over x plus 1 all squared equals to 1. Here, let's multiply through by x plus 1 all squared. And here, this becomes x plus 1 all squared divided by x squared, then minus here, x plus 1 all squared, we cancel each other, and we have minus 1 left, which is equal to x plus 1 all squared, times 1 here will be x plus 1 all squared. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for subscribing and turn the notification bell on. Now, from here, let's minus 1 to this side become plus. Then here we have x plus 1 all squared over x squared. Now equals to, here we have x plus 1 all squared, then plus 1 here. Then next step, let's subtract 2 into bracket x plus 1 from both sides. So minus 2 into x plus 1 on this side. Also minus 2 into bracket x plus 1 on this side. So that here we have the perfect square here. Then this side becomes into bracket x plus 1 all square over x squared then mi minus 2 into bracket x plus 1 here then equals to on this side this becomes x plus 1 all squared then minus 2 into bracket x plus 1 then we have plus 1 that is from here what we have on the left hand side, we have x plus 1 common. And when we factor x plus 1 out, here this will mean x plus 1. Then into bracket, here will be left with x plus 1 over 2, sorry, over x square here. That's over x square. Then minus what is left here we have two. Then we close this bracket. Then on this side, this here can be written as x plus one. Then minus one all square. That is when this here together like this, then minus one. The expansion will give us what we have here. Then next step have plus 1 minus 1 and this cancel out we only have x left here which is x squared then which implies that here we have x plus 1 then into bracket x plus 1 over x squared minus 2 now we now be equal to x squared on this side then next we can divide through by x plus 1. So divide both sides by x plus 1. At this point here, we divide. Then this side, x plus 1, we cancel out. Then we are left with x plus 1 over x squared minus 2. Then equals to on this side, we have x squared over x plus 1. Then from here, let a letter represent x plus 1 over x squared. So let u be equals to x plus 1 over x squared. And then this implies that what we have here, which is x squared over x plus 1, is the reciprocal of this, which is the same thing as 1 over u. Then when we substitute back this in terms of u, then we have 
this equation become u minus 2 now equals to 1 over u then next step we can clear this fraction and multiply through by u here please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell thank you for subscribing thank you thank you now here we multiply through by u and this gives us u square then minus 2u equals to here we have 1 then bringing 1 on this side to form a quadratic equation we have u square minus 2u then minus 1 equals to 0 here so applying the quadratic formula which is u equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a where a in this case is 1 b is minus 2 and c is minus 1 then what we have here now become u equals to minus minus 2 plus or minus square root of minus 2 square then minus 4 times 1 times minus 1 then over 2 times 1 then here we have u now equals to minus times minus plus plus that's 2 plus or minus square root of here we have 4 then plus minus times minus plus then plus 4 over 2 here that is here 4 plus 4 that's 8 then we have u equals to 2 plus or minus root 8 over 2 then here root 8 same thing as root 4 times 2 and root 4 is 2 which is now 2 root 2 so we can write root 8 as 2 root 2 then we have u now equals to 2 plus or minus 2 root 2 over 2 then from here 2 is common here so we can also write it as u equals to 2 into bracket 1 plus or minus root 2 then close bracket over 2 so that 2 cancel 2 then u now equals to 1 plus or minus root 2 so here we have two possible values for u first we have u equals to 1 plus root 2 and the second if we have u equals to 1 minus root 2 now let's recall that we represented u as x plus 1 over x squared then it implies on this side that we have x plus 1 over x squared we now be equals to 1 plus root 2 on this side then same thing here we have u which is x plus 1 over x squared now equals to 1 minus root 2 on this side then we can solve from here by cross and multiply then this will become 1 plus root 2 x squared then equals to x plus 1 then Bring everything to one side to form a quadratic equation, and we have 1 plus root 2 times x squared here, then minus x minus 1, then equals to 0 from here. Now, this is a quadratic equation where a equals to 1 plus root 2, and b is equals to minus 1. Then C equals to minus 1 as well. Then applying the quadratic formula to solve, then X will be equals to minus minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square minus 4 times 1 plus root 2, then times minus 1 then over 2 times 1 plus root 2
2. Then when we simplify from here, we have x now equals to here become 1, then plus or minus root here, we still have 1, then minus 4, minus times minus here, we multiply minus 4 and minus 1, that's plus, so that's plus 4. Now, plus 4 from this bracket, we have 4 plus 4 root 2 there. Then over here, 2 open this bracket, we have 2 plus 2 root 2. Then here, we can write this as x equals to 1 plus or minus square root of, here we have 1 plus 4, that's 5, then plus 4 root 2 over 2 plus 2 root 2 then also we have two you know values of x on this side now also on this side for the second case whereby u equals to 1 minus root 2 then we equate this as well to form a quadratic equation and then this becomes 1 minus root 2 times x squared now equals to x plus 1 also bringing everything to one side and we have 1 minus root 2 x squared then minus x minus 1 now equals to 0 from here now this quadratic equation we have a in this case to be 1 minus root 2 then b here we have minus 1 then C here we have minus 1. Then that means X here will give us minus minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square minus 4 times 1 minus root 2 then times minus 1 which is divided by 2 times 1 minus root 2. Then when we solve and we you know simplify further here yeah, this becomes x will then be equals to sorry please so we have x equals to here we have 1 plus or minus square root of this become 1 then minus times Minus 4 times minus 1, that's plus. So we have 4, we open this bracket, that will become minus 4. Sorry, plus 4 now because plus 4 is opening. Then plus 4, that will be minus. Because of this minus here, minus 4 root 2. Then divided by what we have in the denominator now, which is, sorry please. I want to manage here. 2 open the bracket, then we have 2 minus 2 root 2. Now, from here, when we write the final answer for the second, you know, category here, we are going to have 1 plus or minus root 5 minus 4 root 2, then over 2 minus 2 root 2. Now, it implies from here that let me write it here please. so we have x now equals to 1 plus or minus root 5 minus 4 root 2 then divided by here we have 2 minus 2 root 2 so here we have the second you know cases here we have the solution here which is also plus or minus so we have therefore come to the end of this class and thank you for watching please subscribe for more exciting videos and turn on the notification bell don't forget this step share this video give it a thumbs up and see you next class if you have a comment put it in the comment section see you next class and bye for now